Miley, Mandy, Jason, and myself, we jokingly call ourselves the Core Four. I made up the name the Core Four. I think everyone should know that. We think that we're a little bit of an oddity because we love to create, but we do it together. People became familiar with the family because of TikTok, and they'd see us doing our dances. The next thing we know, people are talking about our blended family. That can't be real, and you must be sleeping with each other. It's so weird that Wayne and Mandy are divorced, and they still hang out. Well, they would look at Jason and say, well, is that Wayne's son? Uh. <laughs> it's weird to you, but to us, it's what we need, because we're family. I love it, because they are family. That was another peek at Wayne Brady, the family remix of gifts. New meaning to the term modern family. We're here with a full core for Wayne, Miley, Mandy, and now Jason, yeah! who is Mandy's life partner. I love that you all lean into the things that people say, like, is it real? Is it fake? They must be sleeping with all these things. That's kind of owning the power of this moment. Is that yep. what you're doing, Wayne? Absolutely. Lean into it. Lean into Lean it. it. Get, take it head on and show the truth behind it. Yeah. Because folks just, folks talk about things they don't understand. So yeah. then just uh, let's illuminate the room and show them. Because you do. So Jason, starting out, you were a backup dancer for, we have video. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, for Wayne, let's play. So this is y'all on stage. Jason is a backup dancer. Wayne is performing. And Mandy, you're there as well. Right. This is she pre directed the show. You directed the show. Yes. This is pre-relationship. Yes. 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 Okay. We were divorced. Yeah, I know you were. <laughs> okay, okay. Man, no, like, listen, Tamara, no we were divorced. No shenanigans. <laughs> we already know that. No shenanigans. But that had to be nerve-wracking because technically, Wayne's your boss. Well, Manny's the boss. Well, the well, boss. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, he Mandy. has to say that before they get on the plane. <laughs> it's a Mandy, six hour flight. It's a, it's a six hour flight home. So yeah, Mandy's yeah, yeah. the boss. Yeah, boss. So even that dynamic, dating your boss and your boss's ex. Is, what were you thinking? <laughs> <laughs> all, all my relationships, you know, I, I wasn't thinking, but I just, I just, I just met Mandy and I never left. I don't yeah. know. That's the simple answer. Um, Are you a person that generally goes? Is it, they always say your heart or your your mind or your heart. Do you lead with? Your... Yeah, I think I lead with my heart. Yeah. And um, I didn't think about it too much. I didn't. I didn't plan it. We didn't. You know, it was just. I. I, I don't know. I don't I know how scared, to explain but... it. You were yes. scared. Mandy what was were scared you, because what were you afraid she... of? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Like, right, you know, because just Wayne admits it took, you said, 10 years of therapy to... Oh, I hated him. Oh, <laughs> oh absolutely. Yeah. What did you hate about him? I hated the fact that it was the, the, the toxic masculinity thing of, of how dare you uh, get with my, my yeah. ex, even if, yeah. even if you're not together, that thing of, yeah. well, maybe we want to be together, maybe I... And I was deluded. I was delusional. I, I, I had a whole thing that maybe we'll get back together again, and how dare you, and that's wrong, and I was angry, and that's my daughter, and you're not gonna be her father, and how you be, all those things. Blah, 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 blah. It took a long time Ten for years. me to that's stop a long that time. noise. Right. Because I knew at a certain point that if my daughter couldn't come home and say that she had a good time out with them, that I was hurting her. Because she loves Jason, so she couldn't even say, oh, I had a good time with Mr. J. So, did, did it suck? Is, is he horrible? <laughs> did you... Come on, man. What was it like, Miley, for you to know that it, at least your dad had gotten to a point where everyone was putting you first? Mm -hmm. um, I think, and you know, that did come later. So, I met Mr. J. I call him Mr. J. You when still I was... call him Mr. J? Yeah, we don't do first name adults in yeah. this house. I love that. Um, <laughs> so... I love you. I met Mr. J when I was six turning seven. Uh-huh. So I think the, the therapy wheels really started turning when I was about 11, 12, I would say. Um, and it was it was honestly really great. I mean, I have the easiest time in the core of work because I'm connected the easiest way. I mean, they had me and he's here. So <laughs> I can, like, this is not a big thing for me, but it was really great. And I'm very fortunate to have as much support as I did growing up. Like, it's amazing having three parents that love you. Um, 
it, it, I mean, it was very easy for me. Yeah. And when great. I stepped in, like, I, I was very clear, like, I'm not the parent. Yeah. And I never assumed that role. I was like, she has two loving parents, you know what I mean, who are involved in her life. Yeah. And so, like, if, if I can help, cool. If I need to step back, cool. And I, and I prioritized that from the jump. And I think that's what allowed the time and, and space to grow closer and closer. Mm -hmm. Very smart. Um, that's because so that a was, lot of people would have yeah. tried to go in and infiltrate <laughs> and all that. That was very astute. Now you um, you and Mandy have your own baby now, yeah. Sundance, yeah, Sunny. Yeah, yes. uh, <laughs> I love that you share your journey of having an open adoption after yes. going through IVF and, and miscarriages, which we talk about a lot on our show. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> now you've got Sunny in the picture. I saw Wayne, you posted a photo of them and, and you talked about loving their relationship oh and the way it looks. That you're con you went from 10 years of therapy to not hate this man to giving a love letter on social media celebrating him as a father. Yeah, because Jason is a wonderful man and not every person who's an ex gets a chance because so many people have conversations where that I. I've never received a call, Wayne, this man is hurting me. Wayne, this man is hurting your daughter. Wayne, this man is, is bad doing that. I've never gotten those calls. When I was on tour, when I'm doing these things and couldn't be, Jason was at parent-teacher meetings with Mandy. Jason was picking her up. Jason, Jason is part of her family. And that's why, no matter what anyone says, if it doesn't work for you, cool, but it damn well works for us. That's it. Uh, so you are together, you've got Sonny, you're on a steamy video set, romantic. <laughs> that guy was cute. He was just an actor though, right? The no, guy? he's an artist. He's, oh. he's, he's Lamar. Eyes Lamar. Lamar. He's Lamar. featured on the song. But he's a friend. He's my friend. Okay. He's my friend. Biz Marquis just sees a friend. But you talk a lot about... <laughs> Thank yeah. you, Wayne. Thank he you. is, he's They're like, friend. who? Um, there's a lot of talk about your dating life on the show and who they think you should date. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. What, what, you, do, the first time I've seen you uncomfortable this whole 38 minutes. Because yeah. <laughs> again, going back, you're teetering between private Wayne and letting us know everything. Yeah. So the pendulum now is in the uncomfortable spot. What's going on with your dating life? Nothing. Nothing. And that's cool. That's because cool. when I was trying, I would try to date and try to have connections and you know that whole thing? about moving too fast yeah. because you're trying to either prove something to yourself or fill a hole right. in yourself. It's like, now I can make, make myself happy. Now I can make myself happy with this person. No, first, I've got to be good with me. Yeah. So that's been the whole right. thing. So now, now that I have announced, you know, said, hey, so I'm at a place where I can fall in love with anybody. Right. Let's see what happens. But I had to do that work first. So, so my dance card is, is wide open. So that means you're open to dating. I'm open to dating. Right. And Miley has specific <laughs> things. What are, what's the dream person you'd like to see with your dad? I think my, my dad is what I call a little prince. So Aww. he's a little high maintenance. <laughs> he's a little high maintenance. Um, <laughs> and I think like they have to meet his maintenance. You know, he likes to have someone that'll talk to him, but is also very quiet and will watch him play video games, but will also banter with him and be witty um, and all of these things. But we also want someone to get along with, right. yeah. you know, that fits well into the dynamic. And we are all, we all, I, I have a big personality, yeah. in case you You inherited it. Can yeah, you tell? I got a big one. And it, it, I'm, so, a, I'm a little hard to impress, I think. Okay, so, so for this to become from core four to core five, Whoever's out there, you're gonna have to pass each one. Yeah. Of these. This is like oh Super Mario Brothers, where you have to jump over moats and things Final like that. Box. Good luck.